Hey guys, in today's video I want to go through device 4 and device scope and really what they mean. So before this video I actually didn't know what they mean so I googled it and I found out that device 4 is actually needed to generate all the routes needed for device. And you can see that with this example here where they are trying to use the user's model configured to use authenticatable, confirmable, and recoverable. So by doing device for users, they generated all these routes. And if we go back to our app here, and if we do something like break routes, you can see that we'll have passwords pointing to or people passwords and confirmations pointing to or people confirmations. And that is really shown here. So the model, in this model, they are in this route, the model they are using is or people, not device. So that's what device 4 is used for. It's used to generate the needed routes, the correct routes that you would need to make your sign up, sign in little widget work. So the same is, can be said for confirmations. And if we remove these, if we remove this definition here, then what will happen is that they will default back to using just plain device instead of or people. And if we have multiple ways of, of signing people in, let's say we have a, sign, a different sign up functionality for admins and a different sign up functionality for users, that's when we would have to define these as either admin or, or users. But we only have or people, so we could just leave it as or people. But just in case, if we ever want to add admin, that's why we want to use or people instead of just plain device. Now, device scope is something that the document didn't really mention. It's at the bottom of the of the page, but it's really it doesn't define it very well. So basically, what device scope is for is pinpoints the certain link to the to to the place you want to get to to the correct route. Now, this isn't correct route, so we could change that to or people for now and that is basically what device scope is for it just turns your sign up so if you go to if you go to lo localhost sign up then it'll point to org people registration hash new and that's all I want to leave us at today uh, please rate comment and subscribe if you have any questions you can leave them in the comments otherwise i'll see you guys in the next video